y'all welcome and or welcome back to my channel i'm bessie nicole and welcome to best life tv where we talk all things black owned so today i have another company for you all i'll be reviewing the honey pot company we all know and love her you know she out here in these streets and tarjay she's in walmart um, I believe she's on Amazon. All right, and it's plant-based feminine care. So I've collected quite a few of her products over some time because sis ain't cheap. All right, so let's just jump right in. I'm gonna start with a product that I know and love that I use the most often, and that uh, that's the uh, panty liners. So these are infused with, these are the organic everyday herbal infused panty liners with mint, lavender, and aloe. And these are just light, you know what I'm saying? Something a little light, something slight you know, for your everyday wear. But I usually use these when I'm on my cycle because typically my period isn't that heavy. So the ingredients are certified organic cotton. There's lavender oil, aloe vera juice, uh, rosa, damascana flower water, hotunia, cordata oil, borneo, and menthol. So this menthol up in here. Is, is you know it's gonna have a, a tingle and depending on your sensitivity it could be just a slight a slight burn for me it's more towards kind of a, a burn sensation for about like five minutes well no not five minutes I would say it's the most intense like when you first put it on and then it kind of you know cools down after about a minute or so um, but like I said, it will depend on your sensitivity because when I first tried them, this girl actually had one um, at, at my job and she gave it to me and she was like, yeah, girl, it's a tingle. And she was telling me like, oh, yeah, I like it. But when I, I tried it, I'm like, hold up. This ain't no tingle. It was it was just a bit much for me. But, you know, like I said, it doesn't last long. And um, yeah, so I like the panty liners and it does have on the back you know as far as depending on how heavy your cycle or your um you know how heavy it is it'll it has the products that you could try based on that right here and here is the panty liner this is the one that it comes in so there's that and then you just pull the pull it off the little plastic right here you know what i'm saying if you want to get an idea how big it is. These are really comfortable. I'll, I'll say that they're super comfortable and um, they work for me. So these retail for $6.99 and you get 30 in the pack. So these are go for me. I do like the painting liners. Uh, next you have the herbal infused pads with wings. And these have the same ingredients as the panty liners. With these, why can I, I don't know what this is. What is your flow, if your flow is a bit heavy, indicated here, like so, then you can get you these here pads, okay? With the wing. So I got these because at the time, my flow was a little heavy and um, because I didn't have the, wings right here you know there was a little leakage but my period was heavy because i had some fish play is mess up okay i have some fish every now and then if i feel like it because like tab say because that's my business okay so um but i am plant-based and uh i do try to stick to the plants for the most part but you know, if I want some fish or some eggs, whatever, I may indulge. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So, um, shout out to my mama. But anyway, anywho, I, I have noticed that, like, whenever I do, um, my flow is way heavier. So, I just wanted to show y'all how big these are. And to be honest, I didn't like these just because they're really, they're, like, super big to the point where they were, like, uncomfortable for me. And I felt like they was just in a way. So, I wasn't really feeling the pads. But, you know... If you are sort of a heavy bleeder, you know, these might be, these might be all right for you. I don't know if I said they retail for $7.88 and you get 20 up in here. So they more expensive and you get less in the pack. I just wanted to put that out there. So the next thing, the tampons, you know, I think it's good to always have some tampons 
on hand just in case. You know what I'm saying? You never know, you might need them. So these are also organic. The cotton is organic. On the back, it says that the, um, the width and length expansion, it conforms to your individual shape for unsurpassed protection. Um, you also have the secure withdrawal core. You ain't got to worry about the core, you know, coming apart from the actual um, pellet um, because it's sewn in the full length of the absorbent pellets. Uh, it's bioplastic applicator. Applicator is derived from sugar cane which you don't want to flush is what it say here on this here package. And then there's a textured finger grip. So it's designed for ultimate control while inserting your tampon. You know, I'm sure you guys know what the tampon look like, but you know, there's that, there it go, or whatever. And it is quite, well, I opened it at the wrong end. Oops, said open it at, at this end. But anywho, uh, there's the tampon. I do like these, you know, they're really small, compact, um, they do come in, just like the pads, come in regular, overnight, and non-herbal if you ain't with the tingle. The tampons don't have any herbal infusions or anything like that, but you can get super compact. You can get a duo pack, and yeah, for the tampons. And regular, which I think these are regular. Yeah, these are regular. So the next product is uh, actually a, cus uh, a product my cousin put me on. Shout out to Sabra. Cucumber aloe wipes, so they're for intimate parts, body, and face, and these are also plant-derived, and you get 30 in here. So with these here wipes, these wipes are $8.29, and these are quite expensive, okay? Um, so I thought I could use these if I was going um, into the gym. I've been working out with my CG folks and at home. So, you know, say if I was going to the gym and I just wanted to wipe up real quick, you know what I'm saying? Then I would use these here. Um, there's cucumber, aloe, and chamomile. So the first ingredient is water. And then you have aloe leaf juice, sunflower seed oil, calendula, flower extract, coconut fruit extract, there's coconut leaf extract, chamomile, cucumber, althea root, glycerin, apple cider vinegar, honey, lactobacillus extract, and some of those I can't pronounce. So quite a long list of ingredients on the wipes, um, but it is cruelty free. Um, so one thing my cousin suggested, and I will say this is, you know, pretty secure, you know, put this here. You gotta put some muscle in it to get that up. So with the wipes, you know, my cousin did say that it may be good, especially cause they're so expensive. You know, you could cut them in half. So that way you got 60 wipes, you know what I'm saying? Because as far as the size, just depending on what you need to wipe, you can maybe cut these in half, you know what I'm saying, get the most for your money. You feel me? So that's the size of the white, bring it to my face, so, you know. So there's that. And uh, so those are the wipes. I haven't tried these. I think I just tried one just because I wanted to see, you know. I wasn't sweating or anything though. I just, you know, kind of used it. So I wouldn't be able to say how it goes, how you can, how it can take you from funk to fresh. Oh, dang it. My daggone earring fell out. Help me, Lord. See, that's what happens when you be doing too much. Somebody out there hating on me through the, hating on me through the camera. Anywho. The last product I have is the Honey Pot Co. Sensitive Foaming Wash. Plant-based feminine care with a pH of 3.4, 3.5, contains collodial silver, cruelty-free, sulfate-free. Uh, you would shake it up and you would pump, it says pump three times. So there's lavender, vinegar, calendula up in here. Um, the first ingredient is purified water, cocoa glucide, I don't know what that is, papyrus malice vinegar, I guess apple. Sunflower seed oil, lavender oil, lavender flower water, grapefruit extract, asparagus root extract, garlic extract, calendula extract, 
propendiol, less than 1%, vegetable-based silver, citric acid, and hydrogen peroxide. So there's that. And for this one, this is the sensitive wash, and you also have the option of getting like normal, the mommy-to-be, or whatever. So this one, I'm not a fan. And I'm not a fan because I feel like whenever I use this, I start bleeding, which is weird. Like, I don't know if it's like cleaning out something. I don't know. Or if I'm like, I don't know. It's, it's, it's weird. So, um, yeah, I'm not really a fan of this. Um, even though it says gynecologists love it, I don't. I don't know y'all, so I'm not, I'm not a fan of this. However, you know, a lot of people rave about it. A lot of people really like this product. It just didn't work for me. So there's that. Um, so that was all the products. Um, also, you could also pay for these if you have an FSA, like a flexible spending account or a health savings account. You could purchase these items using that. So <laughs> there you go, sis. And uh, she also has like a panty spray, if you know, just a little freshener. She has that as well, and I did see that at my Walmarts. Um, I don't know. Yeah, but that wash, I don't know. It seems like it just throws off me my pH. The wipes, I think they're cool. I don't know about for $8, like $9 really after tax. I don't know. I don't know about those. Um, yeah, so the tampons, I would definitely suggest those. The panty liners, I would suggest. The pads, they weren't for me, but you know. If that's something that you, if you like your pants a little bit larger, the ones with the wings on them, sis got you, okay? Um, let me see. Yeah, the liners are perfect. The pads are a little bit too big for me. Just a little rundown, you know, I'm just looking at my nose real quick. But, yep, yeah, y'all, that's it. Comment down below. Let me know if you've tried this product, which I'm sure that you have. Uh, let me know which ones you like, which ones you didn't like. And any other products that you all can suggest that are black owned, leave them in the comments below as well. And thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.